All right, it's time for another new games and stuff, or whatever Jen decides to call this video. Plus, a birthday surprise. I'm Scott. I'm Jen. We're Retro Rivals, and we're going to do another new games and stuff, episode number three. Yes. Jen decided to name the last episode something else, even though right in the video I said this is new games and stuff again, and she was like... Now we're gonna do something else. Okay, but then I'll do it properly this time, or you'll edit it. Edit it? I will edit it. <laughs> you'll edit it, and then it won't be an issue. <laughs> also, you still title it when you put it on YouTube. You know what? Oh, That's well, what you did. Like, right. I edited the last one, <laughs> and then she's like, nah, I'm just gonna call it whatever. Okay, well, then I'll ask you first. I already told you what it is. Okay. New games and stuff. Three. Okay. Also. We're not filming this on my birthday, but it'll release close to my birthday. Yes, so you can uh, wish Jen a happy fruit. No, listen, listen, I want to, I had a whole monologue. Mm -hmm. I had a whole monologue. 28th birthday? I had a whole monologue. I had All a right. whole monologue. Oh. Listen, guys, I've come to the realization and understanding that I can't lie anymore and say I'm 29. So I'm just going to be honest with myself and with everybody else. I'm 35 now, and it's just time to be honest. Oh, yeah, you look like 35. <laughs> 44, <laughs> so whatever. 44 is a good number, Jen. 44 is good. It's my favorite number. I know it is. All right. I'll be your favorite person this year. We'll see. <laughs> All right. Start. Let's do this. Yeah. So the, the, the birthday surprise will be the last thing. It's in the retro room. That'll be great. Yeah. This one right off the top is Jenny. She had to go get it. It is Metroid on the 3DS, yeah. Samus Returns Special Edition. Ole, I got this for a Olé. good price. Olé. I was like shocked when I saw the price on it. And I was like, I must have that. That must be in my collection. Um, oh yes, it, it will, will be, be mine. mine. <laughs> yeah, so as you can see, we're Metroid fans. You can see that behind us. And I've played all of one Metroid game, but I have most but of them. But it was super. It was super. super. Metroid. <laughs> yeah. So I had to have this one too. And uh, tell me in the comment Did section. She waste your mind? No. Tell me in the comment section what Metroid game I should play next that will compare to Super Metroid. I would love uh, to know. Because uh, we have most of them, so. Yeah. I don't know saying. if I want to put that close to you. With my spilly drinking? Yeah. yeah, probably not. Well, I like uh -huh. <laughs> this is a funny story. Why don't you tell this one? Or I'll tell it my own way. Oh. Grand Theft Auto 5. Like what you guys didn't have that yet? No, we didn't. I have actually have not never played a Grand Theft Auto. Yet. Me neither. Uh, I see gameplay of it, I hear people talk, and it just really it doesn't interest me. And maybe you need to sell it to me in the comments. Mm -hmm. But the reason why we picked up this disc is because my son Mr. PC Master Gamer, um, Mr. Doesn't Like Physical Media, went and looked at his copy. And it didn't have the map in Yes, but number four, was it? Yeah. Had an amazing, he comes down, unfolds He's like, his, look, look at this. this, look how cool this map looks, Dad, this is so awesome. I was like, like, that's what you get when you buy physical media. pretty cool, media. right? Yeah. So then he's like, ah, oh, he opens his up, and he's like, ah, oh, I don't have the map, and the number five, and he's like, well, that sucks. I don't know what I did with it. And yeah. like a good mom, I was like, she boy, let it get in the car. <laughs> get in the car. We're going to get it so. right now. And we did. Tell me, guys. Number five, is that a good place to start? Or should I go back? I hear a lot of people say Vice yeah. City is awesome. This, so this is, is a premium edition. Yeah. This is a copy we picked up, and I literally just took the map out because he had, yep. already had the map. So. Trying to get him to have a new appreciation for physical media. Yes. This one here I picked up. Mm hmm. I do realize the order 1886 did not review well at first with fans because of the length of the game. Because if a new game comes out and you're paying full price, you want I've had that same issue with Miles, Miles Morales. Morales. Pay full price, I'm getting like after taxes over 100 bucks there, and I'm like, I have like a five, six hour game, mm -hmm. and I'm like infuriated. Um, this is a similar length, yeah. but at the price point that we got it at. See if it's in here. Um, Seven ninety-five. Yeah. Uh, way more digestible, oh, and I, I do hear it's a really good game. So I want to I try it. I do see it. Um, it's a third-person shooter, 
and I think it's uh, like you're fighting like werewolves and stuff like that. Yeah, so. it sounds really cool. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why I'm separating. I don't know. I don't even have games to grab over here. Ah, here's one for you. There we go. This is Jenna's <gasps> Alone in the Dark. Yeah. Who are we going to blame this Baby on? Generation Pixel. He <laughs> sent me a message. He's like, it's really scary. And I can only play it for <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if he too. said it like that. I think Jen is like, <laughs> or maybe he did. <laughs> he was like, I have to wear my brown pants when I play it. But he did say it took him over a week to complete it because he could only play it a little bit at a time. How long is the game? It's like eight, ten hours. <laughs> Not, but he you no he said he typically plays four hours a day ten hours on the weekend and it took him an entire week because he could only play it in short little spurts four hours a day to play a game yeah wow, i wish i had four hours we were doing the wrong job we're <laughs> sleeping too much when you get older though like he, sleep. listen when you get older you like he is sleep. you need less sleep yeah. so that's why yeah. this one here i picked up it's the ultimate action triple pack it has just cause two Tomb Raider and Sleeping Dogs. And Sleeping Dogs is the reason we picked it up. Yes. Plus it's a triple pack. I was looking at Sleeping Dogs on the PS3, and then I happened to slide over to the Xbox 360, and I'm like, well, it's basically the same price. And I get yeah. three games. I already, uh, And. $9.95. Is there not three discs in there? There's three discs there in there. All three friggin' discs yeah. are in there. So, um. It's a no-brainer. Yeah. I it's have played a good <laughs> amount of Sleeping Dogs, and it was really good and I got mad because I was supposed to be doing a review with two other people and I was pretty sure they weren't playing the game because they didn't play the other one we reviewed. Still love them. I just, at the time I was like, no. <laughs> I'm over it now. I just got to get back to it. I game. played Tomb Raider. I enjoyed it. Yes. Um, that's the only Tomb Raider I played. I played um, both. I have not played Just Cause, any of the Just Cause and then Sleeping Dogs, you said I would love it. So uh -huh. I gave it a try. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna grab. Now we'll do the other. I picked up. You picked this one up. It's called Evil Land, Land, the Legendary Edition. Evil Land One and Evil Land Two. Mm -hmm. uh, RPGs, but I think the the thing about these is uh, when you start as you go through progress through the game. Graphically, I think the game evolves. And stuff oh like that. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I Evil remember Land. the whole story with this is I remember seeing a video about it like a few years ago. Thought it was really cool. Put it in the memory bank. Got Control, deleted. Delete. Got deleted somewhere along the yeah. way. Couldn't remember the name of it. Couldn't find it again. And then all of a sudden, like maybe a week ago or so, mm -hmm. stumbled across the video and it was on that. I was like, "That's the game." That's the so game. I went and tried to find one, and uh, eBay prices were ridiculous. But I got this one on Amazon for a decent price. Yes. I think um, it's a uh, Peggy 12. Uh, I don't think there's an NTSC physical release. Yeah, could be. I don't think there is. At least not on the PS4. Yeah. This one's yours. But don't you? worry, if we're wrong, just like when you know. talked about Rare Replay being on the PS4, people are like, yeah, you must have a special copy we don't have. Hang on to it, it's going to be worth something someday. I'm like, I just love that my husband was wrong. Uh, it was so much fun. You know what, there's a Genesis collection on there. I think that's what I was getting mixed up with. Okay. Maybe. Right. Maybe that's also wrong. I'm probably, yeah, <laughs> I can lay it into me there, whatever. I just wore it. <laughs> that will be it. Yeah. Detective crime thriller, Sherlock Holmes, The Devil's Daughter. Yes. Um, I've been hearing lots about the Sherlock Holmes games on the Xbox 360, which prompted me to want to pick this one up too. I hear they're pretty good, so I'm going to put them on my drawer. <laughs> you know, I, 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 I zoom into the part, you can't even see that. Okay, well. It's for your own craziness. Yeah. Do you want to throw it on the floor? No, not like games? last time. No? No. no idea. Is there anything else you want to say about that one? No, I don't really know all that much more about it than I've heard they're really good. And I thought it would be great to add to the collection because sometimes I need a different experience. I don't always want to be playing the same game, so I like to switch up the genres. So do. I don't know a whole lot about it. But... The other one you picked up, Darksiders 3. Oh, with you the chick. an Xbox kick there. I am. I've played the first Darksiders, loved it. We've got all of them now. This we was have the all last of them between, between different, different consoles. consoles. Yeah, yeah, which is fine. 
I don't, I'm not really console exclusive. Like I don't, I, I don't care to have like, I want it on this one. Although nine times out of 10, I will get them on the PS4 if I see them, but I won't hold back. I don't want to miss a game just because I want it on the PlayStation 4. So. All right, before we have a couple of retro games and three PS4 games for the looks of it, yeah. I'm gonna do the retro games. Okay. So this one here, this one's basically because Dennis told me this is the only other co-op baseball game that he knows of, and it's MLB 99. <laughs> and what I said, I was like, yeah, well, I can I can get the ROM for it, and I can put it on my uh, my PS Classic that I have modded and everything. But when I looked at like the being able to play two people on there, mm -hmm. I would need another dongle yeah. to hook another controller up to. And this it would was cost like more. this was ten bucks. The dongles may it was probably twenty to thirty dollars. Yeah. There, I was like, it'd be cheaper just to buy this and yeah. play it because we're probably only gonna play it a couple times just exactly. for nostalgia for yeah. him. Yeah, because I've never played it. Just hold it up to the camera and say, sports games do matter. <laughs> there we go. Right out of our hot takes video. How much is this driving you crazy? Just try not to think about it. <laughs> and then we went to uh, Flea On Market. On my birthday, Scott. Not yet. Okay. Um, we went to Shediac Flea Market. How much footage did we get? Zero. None. Well, we went on Saturday. The first day of it was Thursday evening for four hours, and then they had Friday, and then Saturday by the time we went later in the day because we're night shift workers. Yeah, we woke up and went like this. Yeah. Oh! Yeah, and we went down there, and um, I only picked up one game, mm -hmm. and it's an Atari game. Yep, yeah. complete, complete box. box. Star Wars, The Empire Strikes Back. You got this for a hell of a price. A really good price. I think he was trying to get rid of it. Yeah. Because he had a price on it. 20, 25? <sighs> 25 maybe and it's worth 55 yeah he so was like i, was like, oh, I looked cool. i'm like what do you got on that and he said he threw a number in and i was like yeah and i was like i'm nah, not really tempted i'm like hey, it's cool it's like it's, it's complete I, I like the fact that it's complete and everything. yeah that's so neat like it even has like it's freaking cool yeah um and then he was like looking uh, at take me it right now he was looking this. yeah he was looking at me he's like this guy's not gonna bite. So he like slashed the price by like almost half. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, yeah, whatever, I'll do it. Yeah. <laughs> but this vendor consistently has good prices. Now, We've seen him at yeah, I've different bought, flea markets and we game. always pretty much buy it from. Have you figured out where this business no. card is? Uh-uh. Maybe I'll figure it out by the time we put this video out and it'll be right here. You want me to put that in the video? I don't have that. I All right, I got Warhammer 40,000 Inquisitor Man, I know that this is murder. Yeah, I don't know if that's how you pronounce that. Murder. murder. My, my, my. I don't know. It is two player. It's co-op. But uh, the catch is that you have your main character, mm -hmm. and then you get another guy, which you don't really benefit from leveling up or getting trophies and stuff like that you're just kind of like a tag along and, I'll, okay. and i'm fine with that if you know to play through it i'll be the tag along guy you're gonna I'm have still to. playing so you get i'm fine with pretty that. mad being the tag along i'm sorry <laughs> in resident evil 6 his name is hunk i made people upset when i was like Ooh. that other guy i'm like I don't read the biopsy of everybody before i play a game like i just play the game his Two name is hunk i'm sorry I apologize. Games. Children of Morta. Morta. Two player game. Uh, pixel graphics looks really cool. I had a hard time finding this, been looking for yes. it for a while. Especially the PS4 copy uh, at a really good price on eBay. I think I paid 20 bucks for yeah, it. Yeah, you got lucky. I, yeah. Taxes in in my hand. 20 bucks. Yep, really can't good. beat that. Um, I think the uh, Switch copies are quite a bit more. As Oops. they are, you're just gonna make a just destructive pile over there, and I hate it. Okay, come on. Last game. PS5 game. Greek Memories of Azer. 
looks so cool. This gave me some kind of Ori yeah. vibes. Yeah, as soon as um, I looked at the back I of it. I think it's Metroidvania. The art style is really cool. Oh, I'm excited. This was on my radar for a while. Uh, just waiting for the game to come down in price. Yeah, yeah, yeah and it did. All right, it is time. Time for Jenny's birthday gift. Okay, check to see how much time you have left. I got six minutes. Okay, then we have like hey. 10 minutes. Just move your drinky drink because you have to keep your eyes closed. Okay. I'll just put it over What there. do you think? <laughs> Apparently when I close my eyes, I do this. Before I bring out your gift. Can I open my eyes right now? Yes. Okay. Before I bring out your gift, <laughs> I want you to take a guess. Because here's the story before you take a guess. The reason why I'm giving her gift early is because I purchased it on eBay. <laughs> and I, I was can't. in bed and her brother calls her and says, are you guys trying to buy something on eBay? That's my best friend, blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, I'm like, shut the fuck. No, wait, I won't shut swear. Shut the front door. Shut the front door, Tony. You can't say anything. And I swear to God, I said this to Scott. I'm like, you can go back and check the Nest Cam because we have a yeah. camera upstairs to check on the dog. I'm like, you could check it. I promise you, he didn't say anything. So, I would never ruin a surprise. I'm like, I hate anyway, I'm like, the cat is getting out of that bag. It's scratching and clawing its way out. So she thinks she knows what it is. I want her to take a guess here in Canada. Oh it's always fun. Oh my God. Hey guys, this is a secret we're sharing between you and I, because he's in there. If it's Clock Tower, I'm going to be pissed and excited at the same time, because that's too much money. But if it is a toy, I think it's maybe Alice from the uh, game, and I think it's her madness dress. This is my guess. We shall see. Come on out! I'm closing my eyes! They're closed. A double closed. All right. All right, open? Yeah. <gasps> That's her address. Well, you won't see that, right? Uh, let me flip it, flip it. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna close my eyes. There you go. A toaster? Yeah. I think I probably guessed right. Ah! I don't know which one yet, but I think I guessed right. Is it the madness dress? Yes. Hence so why cool. I had to do the early, for the early reveal because, you know. Okay, one second, one sec, one sec. Lacey's gonna be so upset if I don't do that. Oh wait. Weak. Weak. Is this like the toughest stuff in the world? I can't do it. I'm just too excited. Okay. Right. Oh. got the pepper grinder, it's got the hobby horse, she's got her madness dress just covered in blood. This makes so much I, more sense, we needed a fourth one. I had uh, I had put an offer in on uh, one from Ontario, and the guy didn't even reply, he didn't deny it or nothing. I keep saying madness dress, it's her hysteria, Alice, yeah. But, but yeah, she's just... Anyways, what were you saying? I cut you off. I said I had put an offer in on one from Ontario, and the guy didn't even reply back. Didn't, yeah. He just let the time run out. He's like, whatever. As soon as the time ran out, there was another one I found uh, closer to home. Yeah. Which is too close because apparently he knows family. <laughs> yep. Oh man, I love this so much. Uh, no, it will not be being opened. Um, the rest of them are sealed, so I got to keep this one sealed too. When we had, and I'll take a, some B-roll of this, when we started moving things on that back wall, uh, cause I made a painting and so we changed some things around and I was like, there's a missing spot right there that doesn't make sense. I'm like, I'm gonna need another Alice figure, tee hee hee. I, and then he hint, got hint, me one, hint. hint, hint, hint. And then he got me one. I freaking love it. It's so cool. Well, I'm happy to enjoy Thank it. you so much. Um, I have no idea what he paid for because I'm just. 
I just don't want to know. No. Nope. Yeah. Is this the last of them? No, there's one more. Oh, Jesus. And there's a whole other set. No! Nope. Based off the first game. I haven't played it yet. <laughs> I do have it! Thanks to and a I think there's awesome way more person. figures in the oh, first set. Oh, no, let's not do that then. Let's not get it. Nah, <clears throat> birthday gifts for years. For years and years. All right. New games and stuff, number three. And stuff! I got the stuff! You got the stuff? I got the stuff. All right, guys. Let us know in the comments what's your favorite pickup, why it's uh, Hysteria Alice, and uh, <laughs> happy birthday to you. You probably had one this year. <laughs> probably. <laughs> or if you didn't, you have one coming up. Until next time, game on.